All right, guys, so it looks like CJ's so cool and worried to daughter they had broken her arm. Now, CJ did took to his Instagram, post a picture of his daughter with a cast in her arm, and he said, who remember when Kamari went through this? Now, he also put up another post on his IG story because he don't want people to go um to royalty's uh ig account and start blaming her for what happened today he goes and said i am a choice so much it's actually scary but i am proud of myself like i am proud of cordelia for being strong through her arm injury kids always face the risk of being injured just exploring the world through their little eyes so i can't blame her mom for this just as i'm expecting you all to not turn this into anything overwhelming the good thing is i took her to the doctor and i got her the right treatment to prevent failure injury so guys leave a comment down below and let me know how you feel about the situation what cj so cool is saying about you know people not to blame royalty of the injury that their daughter had gotten now we're gonna go and jump into this next tea now apparently um neek Decided to address people coming for King Kaiser stating that Dwayne is the father of Kaiser. Now, she was, you know, really didn't like what they were saying in the comments. And also, Dwayne wasn't there feeling too thrilled about what people were saying that Kaiser looked it like him. Now, she had more things to say about the situation. So, we're going to go right now and jump. feel about people calling d and Kaiser's dad? I don't like it. Like, I do not like it at all. I don't think it's funny. I, I I get like you know the jokes and stuff like that and I get that I put you guys into this whole we all put you guys into this whole bubble of the parenting and stuff like that but I just don't think that's very nice from my supporters from anybody I don't like it I feel like it would really hurt my heart if somebody was going around and calling you know calling somebody else my child's mom and um, neither of us feel that way. Dwayne doesn't feel like he's Kaiser's dad. Dwayne is very respectful of Kaiser and his dad's relationship. And I just, I don't like it. Like, I just really don't like it. I just don't feel like it's a good feeling for somebody to say that about your parenting. And then especially um, off camera, you guys, we all, all are working to be better parents. Uh, explain himself he is working to be a better parent he's he's working on being more hands-on and um, helping more so um, even with the uh, I'm trying to remember what it was that had happened um, and oh the even the school supply thing I wasn't gonna address it and I wasn't gonna like um, talk about it when I made the video it wasn't my intentions when me and um it wasn't my intentions when me and Dwayne did the vlog about when me and Dwayne did the vlog about um taking Kai to school shopping I just didn't it was just a vlog that we were doing I didn't know that it was gonna blow up and just be like this whole thing um, you know, and Swain did ask me, did I need help with college school, school stuff, haircuts and groceries and stuff like that. And that stuff that happens behind the scenes. And I realized once we have, once we post all this stuff, you know, that goes on, I know y'all, you guys are going to have questions and concerns about, you know, what's going on in the personal, in the, in the personal bubble and like what's going on in real life. But, uh... Yeah, it wasn't like that. Everybody helped with Kaiser. It was a very much a group effort. Um, everybody helped prepare Kaiser for school. Even though he wasn't here physically, um, he helped and he was on the phone with Kaiser. Um, yeah, and I just really don't, I really don't like the comment. I know I can't control how people feel and I can't control what people see on social media, but we all are, I'm oh, sorry, my camera cut off. We all are working as a group to um you know give Kaiser the best life he can possibly get and also live how and follow our own dreams at the same time um I don't have a problem with him being in Thailand I don't have a problem with him following his dreams of um you know and doing what he wants to do I'm enjoying being a mom I'm enjoying me you know having Kaiser here with me I, I'm enjoying the whole thing and I know a lot of people ask me that question. It's just like everywhere. It's all on TikTok. It's all everywhere. And I was very much a wishy-washy about if I should speak on the topic or not because I just didn't want to say like 
the wrong thing or just put too much of i just feel like we just putting too much of the personal business out there but we did start off with just putting the whole thing on social media but i don't like the comment um and i don't know Dwayne doesn't really like the comment he he said that he doesn't think it's right we don't think it's funny we just we actually feel we don't and i it wasn't my intentions to start uh the narrative that um Dwayne was doing more um, we all work as a group to do what we can for our kids and that's just that all right guys so leave a comment down below and let me know how you feel about the situation which i am glad that she did address the situation because it's kind of you know a shame that they going out the way and trying to you know bring king down i understand that he's not constantly with kaiser and he's doing his own thing but he also playing a role as a father you know and we don't actually know what goes behind the scene and for people to say that you know his son looks like Dwayne is kind of a shame because that's very disrespectful but i'm glad nick had addressed the situation so just leave a comment down below and let me know how you feel about this and i'll catch you next time with a brand new video